Fabio, 1 0 Wednesday night under the lights. Talk to me about that game, mate. Um, we played some good stuff at times, um, created a lot of chances, and on another day we win it, I think, 3 4 0. Um, but we made it hard for ourselves by not taking those chances, and obviously we had to defend, we had to show a, a side of us that was probably a little bit different to Saturday where we won. 5-0 and, and was flying so no we, we know to be successful we have to have games like that where we're going to dig in um, we've got a clean sheet I thought defensively we were superb uh, we, we dealt with the aerial um, battle and we picked up first and second balls but we know we can play better um, we know that but at the end of the day you can have games like this where you need to go away from home and win 1-0 and, and, and it's a good feeling. You talk about them, uh, them chances created and, and the chances missed today. Is that the difference it was today from it being a scoreline like we had on Saturday? Yeah, I think so. I think um, if you give any team hope um, at 0-0, there's hope. At 1-0, there's hope. Even at 2-0, there's hope. If you go 3-0 up, um, you, you start to see the gaps open up um, and teams come out and, and it, it just makes it much easier. So. I think, yeah, if we get a second goal, it opens up the game and we we'll probably get a third and a fourth. And we, we had enough chances to get three or four today. Um, so we made it tough for ourselves. But at the end of the day, the most important thing was the three points. So Saturday, the game was won through our through our goals and our, and our attack and play and, and scoring five really good goals. Um, today's victory, we've we've got to put it down to the to the defence, haven't we? How good was that defence today? Yeah, yeah, I agree with you. Um, I think Mikey was superb in goal. When he had to deal with crosses, he came and dealt with crosses. Cookie, Jamie, um, Fakeo, all three of them were, were outstanding. And then obviously the wing backs and, and not just that the midfields. Um, and look, the front three might have not had the best day in front of goal, but you know what? They, they worked hard for the team and, and made it hard for them. Uh, Sutton coming Rovers to play out from the back. So that doesn't go unnoticed. Yes, but they could have taken the chances, but they also played their part in the victory in, in the way they defended. From a personal point of view, you've had a couple of games out from the uh, from the knot you picked up uh, away at Southall. Uh, how did it feel being sort of back in the middle of the park? It wasn't the, the nicest of game for you to play in. No. Um, I don't think I've ever seen a player head so many balls in <laughs> midfield. Um, but how was it for you being back out there? Yeah, no, it's, yeah, I was delighted to be back out there. To be honest, I, I don't even think I was meant to play today. Um, I didn't think I was going to play until this morning. Um, so, yeah, it was just good to be back out on a football pitch doing what I love. So, it was, yeah, it, I enjoyed the victory. Fantastic. Fabio, excellent performance from yourself um, and the boys out there today. Um, to the Leverhead fans, we are away at Westfield on Saturday, 3 o'clock kickoff. So, make sure you get yourself down there to support the boys. Fabio, thank you very much. Brilliant. Thank you very much. Cheers.